The governor said today that the website allowing people to apply for that grant was actually opened prematurely. So that means there still may be another chance to apply for some of that $15 million. That money is meant to help businesses get essential cleaning equipment and personal protective equipment. Arkansas business owners looking for help asked for nearly $36 million in total, far more than what's available right now. Uh, so $15 million went extremely quickly. Um, the demand is there. So I think that's a, a positive thing that we're seeing out of this is the fact that uh, a lot of uh, Arkansas businesses are ready to reopen. Uh, they want to do so in a safe manner. That high demand meant an extremely short period of time to apply. Dance by Elise missed out. Now they're still open and have been surviving by doing virtual dance classes. When the applications opened, I was teaching class and as soon as I was finished with class, there was no more funding left, so I couldn't apply. She hopes she can hold in-person classes as soon as this summer, but the best way to proceed is uncertain. I'm not sure. It's, it's a difficult place to navigate. Um, I think praying and putting out some good vibes and hoping for the best. Secretary of Commerce Mike Preston is hoping to get more money for the Ready for Business program. He has this advice for businesses that didn't get to apply. Stay tuned to our, our website for updates. If, we, if we're able to, to reopen that application process, we'll, we'll probably send out some, uh, some notice in advance via our, our you know, social media. The appropriated $15 million still needs to be approved before it can be dispersed to any of the applicants. Governor Hutchinson said today that 92% of the applicants were businesses with 50 or fewer employees. Reporting live, Cole Zimmerman, 4029 News.